My art studio began in Bridgewater, uh, but really prior to that I always had art classes in my home back in the 60s. I had art classes in Tamaqua Village as far as the community building goes. I had art, art classes in the basement of this building and then I decided to formalize it a little bit more when I was coming close to retirement from my bank job. I would say the techniques that I try to share with my students are techniques that I was taught as a young artist. Um, those techniques would be painting all of prima, painting in glazes, and certainly learning the five basic shapes and the five planes of light. I love to travel. Traveling is essential for an artist. To travel to Europe, to understand the cultures, to paint with other artists from Europe is wonderful. And you also bring back to your students here a certain element from painting with the cultures and the people in Europe, so yes, I do travel. As far as talking about an achievement with the art studio would be, number one, having the volume of students that I have, being able to teach them in an atelier atmosphere, which is an art studio atmosphere, in that, that there is classical music, there are fundamental basic art principles and concepts taught, there are casts to work from, all of the elements that, that artists would build from from early on would be the advantages of having that happen, as well as paint myself. I love my art studio and I like to paint here. Um, I've been with Carol for about three years. Um, and as you know, she's uh, shown me how to draw in charcoal and pastels and oils. And um, before I joined, I couldn't do any of that stuff. So I'm very happy that I joined. It, I got very good results. Well, I found out about the studio a couple years ago when my mom was looking at art classes for me and she just uh, found in um, the yellow pages, I believe, um, the art studio. So we went down to check it out and I really liked that. So I decided to join. Carol has helped me by teaching things that I wouldn't have learned normally. Um, she really um, taught me in a stricter way than most art classes because usually it's very project based. So um, I just do what I want, but with what she does, um, even though it's more difficult, she teaches me step by step what I should be doing. We started with um, charcoal and then we move on to pastel and then to oils, that's how everyone works. Um, Carol is really into process. Um, she just loves anything because that's how life is oftentimes. We have to go from one step to another and we're always moving forward. She's very insistent upon that. So we never are stuck in one place for too long. She always pushes us and sometimes it's difficult but it's really for our good. I have goals for the future that really encompass the art studio and its students. I think that's critical to continue to expand my own artwork. Um, through networking with other artists as far as art techniques and approaches go. And I really think that that's important to continue to provide the students with current information so that they can become better painters, thus become better students, thus become able to uh, go to apply to college with a good portfolio.